All right, yo, what is, what is uh, maxim of law? Are you taking uh, off that? Maxims of law are uh, derived from like old Roman uh, law, then they're used in common law, and it's basically a precedent which cannot be abrogated by any other uh, forecoming law. Um, precedent, what's uh, uh, the definition like, of that? Uh, you, were, you were explaining it better than I was uh, earlier, but uh, basically it's um, a standing point that cannot be yeah, changed or altered. Uh, uh, a few maxims that sovereigns use as, uh, is like, uh, n no man can question another man's divinity. Uh, this is what a lot of child of God. This is this is this is That's some quotes. That's a maxim of law. Yeah, it's uh, no okay. man can question another's divinity. That means you can say like I was created by Mother Nature, and no man can say no. Jesus was your creator. You know, like yeah. no man can question your divinity. There's also um, such things as um, fuck. I don't even got a lot of them memorized. They're they're all in the front of the law book. Okay. There, but a maxim of law is. Cannot be abrogated by any other forecoming law. And so, so there should be co with the so sovereign knowledge. It should be a combination of common law and maxim of law well, to the, hold power, right? Yeah, the maxims of of law are used in common law, like they're just uh, um, like statements which cannot be overruled by any other See, law. The whole problem is that we're in Canada, and Canada likes to say it's the rule of law. And which is what is the rule of law? Is that yeah. due process? Well, what is the rule of law? Well, to them, it's all their statutes, regulations, acts. No, because you give it to the rule of yeah. law. But, but what is the law? The law is common law, and then even if you look at their law, I've already explained earlier, like it's broken down that way. All this, everything that breaks common law is unlawful. And anything that has nothing well, to do with common law is illegal. Well, really. this is this is what I read. The rule of law, um, when the Magna Carta got signed by King John, the rule of law was then created. That's what I read. No, no, no. That's, that's, that's very misleading. No. The Is rule it of really? Law, the rule of law existed since, like, the first creation, the first evolution, whatever you want to believe. The it was rule prior of law, to man. Yeah, the rule of law is before man, like, there's <laughs> many other forms of law, like before in common law, there's natural law, which allows you to be here and allows you to film me and me to stand in front of you, like, these, there, there's the laws of physics, there's the laws of nature, these are, these are all coming before man, but the rule of law, it can, it, law, like, law, is principle, it can't be diminished. The rule of law can be given to things which aren't law. Like because they're not, they're, yeah, like a statue which isn't law, but has been given the rule of law because you accept it as that. It's just like, you know, like you aren't a citizen of Canada, but you've been given the status of a citizen, right? Yeah.